if you want to know how to make the super cool mist effect in Minecraft, then be sure to stick around because I'll be showing you guys just exactly how to do it. So let's get right into it. Um, so first thing that you would like to do is you want to obviously get an area that you want. Um, and you want to put lava at the very bottom of it. So just like this. Um, I will be using some editing by going like fill from here, 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 and to here with, um, say just dirt. I will be using that because uh, it will make things go a lot faster. Can I do one? No, I cannot. But I can't just do a stone. There we go. Uh, so I will be using that, but, um, so yeah, I wouldn't suggest doing it so big, but it's up to you guys what you, uh, would like to use. So this is actually a trick with glass. And by the way, there are going to be noises everywhere today. I'm, I can't help that right now. Um, but anyway, you want to get colored out glass, whatever color you want it to be. In this case, I'm going to do purple. And then you want an accent color. So like, for example, purple is going to be my main color, and then like this magenta pink is going to be my accent. So, um, what you want to do, I just made like this little rail thing right here because I think it would be really cool to like have a little setup thing set up so like you could basically just go over and there's mist everywhere as you're going over, and like it's, I made it nice and slow too. Uh, yeah, I think that'd be look really cool. So, now what we must do is we're going to get started. So after you place in your lava, what you want to do is you want to place your accent block and then your main block and then your, wait. Okay, yeah, and then, ooh, my bad. Let me just get stone. Um, and then your accent and then main. And you do this six times right on top of your lava like that. And now if you look on top of it, uh, you can kind of see the lava at the, um, at the very end, but you can kind of see that mist effect uh, happening. So if we come right here though, and you can do another one if you really just don't like to see that lava at all. Uh, it's better farther away though. So yeah, um, I think I'm just going to stick with this right now. And then uh, basically all you want to do is you want to just continue that out like so and that's really all there is to it it's that simple uh, so you just bring it out all the way and you keep on doing this and the finished product looks amazing and you can do this with any color you want so what I, wait, you just gotta be careful make sure you're doing it right so what I think I'm going to do is I think I might do like half of this one uh, purple and then the other half another one uh, just to show you guys like um, that you can do it different colors. Uh, so yeah, I'll be right back uh, when I'm done and have the finished product. And okay, here we have uh, the purple, and I think it looks really cool. Of course, I'm not like the best at designing things in Minecraft, uh, but I think that this effect is just like really, really cool. Uh, you can also do like the screen and it'll kind of look like poison or something like that. Uh, I don't know if I really like these all over the place, but it's up to you guys when you design it. Um, also, one thing that you guys might have just noticed after I jumped off a minute ago is that these particles come out when you jump and it looks like lava. See? You see through the glass basically. And this can be better shown when you throw a block on the ground. Oop. It actually has to be a glass block. Uh, it basically sees through uh, all this glass. And so it's a little bit weird, but it still works. Um, and I don't think that many people will notice that because I don't think many people are going to go swimming in mist. Uh, but yeah, it's just a really cool effect. Also, another thing that you can do if you're skillful, which I am not with um, when it comes to command blocks, is basically you can make a kind of setup like this where you have like three or four or five command blocks and you run the line into here then this one goes off and basically it clones something like 
this over here. Uh, it clones this and it displays it on here, like changing these up a little bit. And then after a few seconds, the next command block goes off and you have another one of those set up with different things and then that changes these again and like it can just look really cool it looks like the mist is kind of like flowing or something like that uh it does attract a lot of bats if you do it <laughs> in a um, dark place uh but also i really do want to show you guys what it looks like without the lava uh, i just want to like show you guys how important the lava is to have can you swim in lava in the new update is that thing apparently not Oh, oh, geez. Uh, I was almost falling to my death. Okay, give me a second to try to show you guys this. This might take a minute, uh, but I'll get it set up. Okay, so now it's like completely dark. This is without the lava. This is why lava is super important. I don't really know why it's really light over here. Even if I covered that up, it's still like... Uh, shows really brightly over here. It's just weird. <laughs> Don't really understand it. Oh, wait. Duh. Uh, yeah, I, I fell out of the world, so I died. And there we go, yeah. Um, it just doesn't look nearly, nearly as good. That's where I fell out of the world right there. Uh, yeah. So, like I said, you know, test out different colors. You can do this on a much smaller scale. Uh, it's just a lot of fun to mess around with. It's such a cool tool to have. Um, so yeah, I su really do suggest going and trying it out for yourself. And I have just a few more testers for you guys. Keep in mind, uh, these look much better on a sm uh, much bigger scale. And also when it's like pitch black outside, uh, I think time set 14,000. That should make it like totally night. Uh, anyway, so first we have the green. Uh, once again, you know, it's much better on a bigger scale. Just keep that in mind. Uh, but yeah, this one looks pretty okay. I mean, it looks, it looks interesting, especially like that. Uh, we got our blue, which I absolutely love, actually. Um, yeah, once again, much bigger scale is better, and when you're farther away, it is better, too. And then we have our red, which I also really, really like. Uh, I just find this, um little tool really really cool tool cool <laughs> i like that anyway and then yeah i don't think anything really beats the purple though for me at least Ooh, this looks really cool like that though yeah uh so if you guys um whoa i can't get out oh, wait there it is ah there we go uh, if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button and if you really enjoyed it then make sure to hit that subscribe button uh, anyway, I think that is it for me today, and thank you guys just so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys on my channel soon. Bye! <laughs>